All we're going to need for this assembly is the LED, our battery, and our 3D printed parts. An LED will have a long and a short leg, the long leg corresponding to the positive side and the short leg the negative. To assemble this, we're going to insert the short leg right through the center hole and we'll take that long leg and just run it through that channel and bend it to the side. Now we'll go ahead and grab that short leg uh, using a pair of needle nose pliers and just go ahead and thread it back through that other hole and then pull it from the other side um, so that's nice and taut. Next we'll grab the long leg and we'll go ahead and slot it through the side holes and then do a similar thing where we're just going to go ahead and thread it back through the hole and then again pull it tight. Um, you're going to want to grab a pair of uh, snippers here to go ahead and cut that piece off and we'll do the same thing with the top um, top lead. We'll also go ahead and snip that off. Uh, next what I did was I just grabbed a small little screwdriver, a little flathead, and just um, inserted those leads into those channels and just flattened it on the bottom. Now when we print this, um, the bottom part that lays on the bed usually has a little brim around it. So what I'm doing here is just taking a file and just filing that off because this is going to be a pretty tight fit once we get that cover on. Now to attach the cover, we're simply going to align those two slots and then just apply a little bit of pressure and it should snap right into place. Next we'll grab the battery. When you place the battery, make sure to place it negative side up. And then we're going to go ahead and align the opening on that top part to the bump out on that bottom part and simply make sure it's uh, perfectly aligned and then just snap it into place. To turn on our LED, we're just going to go ahead and rotate it to the on position. And to turn it off, we'll rotate it to the off position.